to our channel. We are so excited to be here, you guys. It's thrill. Oh, it's been a busy day. February the 6th. Is, is it correct? really? Yeah, it's February the 6th. This is the No, first. it's the third. You scared me. Isn't it the third? Oh, I'm totally looking at the You're in January. Year. It's the third. I'm sorry. I, was I like, think how is January hundred. almost over? Or I mean February. Because <laughs> I haven't changed my calendar. Okay, here's the deal though. This Let's leads us into it the It does. Next Perfect saga. Into every year. Kefrin and I, we on our Instagram, Saga on our segue. Saga say, we say, when will January end? D didn't you say something like, is this 594th day of January? Last like year. literally, Januarys are the worst. They're terrible for our family. Awful. They are just a bad time of year, okay? And so anyway, and then they tend to be long. You've had all of this build up to Christmas. Yes, we're all Even sad. Even if it wasn't, everybody has a little bit of a letdown after Christmas. Exactly. And so um, we just, you know, and then it's my birthday and it's Dave's birthday. And, you know, it's hard. It's right after Christmas. It's just not necessary. We should, it isn't. We should change to July. Shame on you for being born then. No, it's well, not my decision. Anyway, this year, it just flew by. What happened? We don't know. We are just like, we don't, we don't know. I, we didn't go back to school for a little bit. Yeah. It, was, it was a little bit later in January. And then we got COVID. And then we got COVID. And we were kind of just, time went by and I don't think we realized it. Do you know what I mean? Right. We were here at the house. Maybe Lincoln made it better. Maybe Lincoln made it better. I don't know. We had lots of things. You had some things going. Kind of, you know what Did I mean? I? Yeah, I don't remember. I think I've blocked out everything in the past year. Anyway, but she, and so that was kind of busy. But you guys, it was just so fast, which makes me nervous now because usually after January, everything goes boom, 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 right. boom. Right. It just like goes fast because February is a short month anyway. It's a short month, Mom. Okay. So I don't know. It makes me, I will tell you that March kind of drags on at school. There's no breaks. Oh, yeah. There's no um, anything. It's a hard one. March is a hard one to keep up all the things. Whereas in, even in February, we have President's Day off. You know what I mean? So I don't know. It's it's anyway. Well, and you started back to work. You guys. And so, you know, I mean, it's just been, by the way, Lincoln is with grandpa. He is. This is shocking. And he may be falling asleep. I, I don't, don't know. know. Who knows? Okay. That's where Lincoln is right now. If, if you hear it, if he gets fussy, he'll come down. Yes. Okay. So anyway, you guys, it was fast. January was fast. And it was. We had COVID. We were kind of here. I didn't notice the dates. We just kind of, you know. Anyway. All right. So. I hear a cry. Oh, I hear a Lincoln. Oh, I hear a Lincoln. Mom's going to go get it. Okay? All right. You guys, that was the first thing we had to talk about. Tell us what else, Kim. Okay? And then I had to tell you. That I went, I'll, I'll talk to you while Kef goes to get him. I went to the Craft Center of Fine Stitchery on Saturday because I haven't been able to go anywhere because of COVID. So this Saturday was the first time I could run some errands. And I, I mean, I could have gone last week, but I was teaching. So I went to the Craft Center of Fine Stitchery and I dropped off my um, Positivity Sal to be framed. That's right. Okay, you didn't bring and it. I said, I know. Okay. And so I dropped it. I said, Debbie, why didn't you Instagram story when you were there? I'm sorry. Debbie. I should have. I don't know. But anyway, they were, um, they had a lot of new patterns in, a lot of fun new things. And we've got some that we're going to show you that I picked up when I was there. Um, it just felt like I needed to get some springy things. So I got a couple of spring things while I was there. And maybe a giveaway. And maybe a giveaway that I got that I thought you guys, it, it would Stay just, tuned. it would make your heart sing because it's, it's, it's a good um, color. It's those springy colors, you know, anyway. So went to Craft Center of Fine Stitchery. It is getting framed. The um, Positivity Sal is being, no, no, no. 
yeah, Positivity Cell is being framed. Um, I'll probably have it in a week or two. And, and I kind of like what we did with it. But anyway, okay. And then um, I got quite a bit of stitching done this week. Kefren has been working hard with the old, oh, I forgot to bring some books. Dang it. That's okay. Um, she's been working hard at work and we're trying to get Lincoln to sleep through the night, you guys. If you have anybody, if anybody has any suggestions, this is the problem. I'll tell you the problem. He doesn't take a pacifier. He doesn't suck. You guys, we've tried every pacifier known to man. And, and he just, uh, and he doesn't take, he knows that the pacifier isn't going to give him anything. He gets it. He's smart. He won't suck his thumb. He needs something to soothe him. He's starting to suck his fists. Is he? He slept for 15, 20 minutes with his fist in his mouth the whole time. Today? So, uh, and here's the deal. He thinks he has to nurse, you know, and, and so. He doesn't. He doesn't have to nurse. Okay, no. here's the situation. Now, I don't need any of your judgments. We sleep together, okay? It's the only way I get sleep. And she needs to get some sleep. So, we sleep together. It isn't, you know, it's on her. Okay, go ahead. Keep going. Keep going. <laughs> it's not on me. <laughs> he isn't always on you? No. Oh, I thought he was. No, he's next to me. Oh, well, okay. I would think that would break, you could break him easier. I thought he break was all, him, what do you I mean? thought he was always on your chest and could hear your heart. That is how uh, it was at the beginning. Okay. okay. Like when he was first born. Okay. Because he was so tiny. Well, yeah. But now he's so big. Okay. I sleep like this. It's honestly, if you look it up, there's a safe way to sleep with your child. And this is the safest way. Okay. Okay. You have your hand out like this. Okay. And you sit on your side. Okay. So he's basically like curved inside of me. Okay. Is he on his side sort of? He's kind of on his side. If, okay. I, if he's not nursing and he's asleep, I'll turn him so he's not like getting suffocated by me. Okay. But that's how we, and then he, he's usually on his side just sucking on me. We've got to stop this, folks. You know what? You may have to get a hold of La Leche. Okay, we might have to, La Leche would give you some good ideas. Here's the situation. He can't, he doesn't even nap well. No, he doesn't. He doesn't, like, I have to be holding him at all times. He, he will in the swing. Even someone said in our last YouTube video, Kevin, do you ever set Lincoln down? We don't. We never set him down. Yesterday I'm, we had a glorious day. Yeah. He took two large naps in the swing. Yeah. And, and I and I very say, rare and I say to her he, he, he's just got to learn do you know what I mean and so you have to keep trying right so then last night I was determined we have a snoo I was like okay this is our night people <laughs> my back hurts everything hurts because I have to keep this arm out and it's just weird so I'm like okay tonight is the night he's gonna sleep so I like crank up the heat because I'm convinced that he is. He, he, he likes, he to likes be being warm. warm next to me. So I crank up the heat. I double swaddle him and put a minky on top of him. Wow. I turn the snoo on. Was it moving? So it's moving. What about the, 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 the white I noise? I have the white noise machine going. Okay. One hour. And, and and then did you uh, did you immediately pick him up? What did you want me to do? Let no. him I'm not gonna no. let him cry. Do and, not put it in the comments. No, down no, below. I'm not. I don't want you to have him cry. I know. But I wonder if you waited 15. I try and do it like this. I try and put my hand on his chest. I try and like lean in. and I say, shh, it's okay, it's okay. <laughs> and it, and and that's Nothing. no good. Okay. But maybe I need to wait like 15 minutes. Yeah. We need to start doing that. And we need to do La Leche. We need to contact La Leche. What are they going to say? Because they're so into nursing. They can help us, Kath. They really are good. And then it's like, okay, everything is about sleep training. I'm not going to sleep train. No, no, I've no. read too many terrible things about sleep training. So then, um, what was I going to say? I don't know. See, she forgot. <laughs> She's so sleep deprived. That's why. So that now Lincoln's big thing is just kicking all the time. 
Oh, I ordered the Magic Merlin suit. Oh, that's right. That's right. I don't okay. even think it's going to do anything. I've given up on that, too. It hasn't even arrived in the mail. $50 down the drain. Okay. Well, anyway. It looks like you, they're like the State Puff Marshmallow Man. Because then yeah. I'm convinced, oh, he jerks himself away. Which they talk about. But that. I don't think he even does that. Well, and that's he why. He just has to be with him. And that's why you swaddle him, too, so he doesn't. Exactly. It. Okay. But also, you guys, I don't know. Anyway, we're going to work on it. If you have any suggestions besides letting them cry it out, because I don't believe in that either, yeah, then send them our way, okay? Because it's like, oh, I don't know. I w I often wondered if we like spent the night here mm -hmm. and Debbie set him down to go to sleep, mm -hmm. if he would sleep, mm -hmm. or if it would be like an hour for Debbie too. Mm -hmm. Then I also wonder if Stephen gave him a bottle right before he goes to bed. What would that do? I don't nothing. I, I, you don't think it would fill him up more? No. It has nothing to do with him being full. It's just being with you. He is 100% full. Okay. But one thing is we're going to the pediatrician next week, and I know he's going to have start doing solids. And that should make a difference. It's not going to make a difference. The kid is going to be sleeping with me until he's 12. Okay. <laughs> Although I do remember feeling that way, especially with Matt. I do remember feeling that way, but he didn't. He didn't sleep. He didn't anymore. sleep with you every night though, Mom. No, he didn't. He didn't. <laughs> he did though for the, at the very beginning, Kat. Oh, okay, He did great. at the very beginning because he was so upset. We're on six months here, people. Yeah, he, I, I, but then I had gotten so frustrated because he was, he, he was hurting so bad. Right. And you feel terrible for yeah. him. Yeah. So anyway, all right. Okay. There's the complaint okay. of the day. That is our, I'm so sorry. This is really a, a this is a floss tube about cross stitch. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, okay, here we go. Now we're going to talk, should we talk about cross stitch? Yeah. Yes. Okay, all right. Oh, and Kefford went into work this week, you Oh guys. my gosh. She went into work on Monday and Stephen kept Lincoln. It was just a little bit of a, to see how it would go. And, you know, both Lincoln and Stephen were exhausted. When Kefri got back. <laughs> but it's good. It is good. It's good. I felt so rejuvenated. Did you? Okay. It was a little scary. Okay. I was like, oh, this, this is, is nice. Yeah. But I felt terrible for Lincoln the entire time. Okay. I didn't feel terrible for Steven. No, no. He needs to learn how to take care of the Lincoln. It was a wild time. Okay. All right. Okay. So should we move on to yes. questions? Okay. All right. You guys, I worked on... I'll be the official oh, sure. shower. Baby, it's cold outside. I got more of the... Uh, Lost in Floss. Lost in Floss. Barb I, and Leanne. I got more of the... What's the edge of it called? The... Border. The border done. I got more of the border done. Now you'll notice, wow, all these colors are different. That's because we use My Life with Miss Sassy. Yep. Um, the blue colors that she suggested, and I'm loving them. She really killed it. I love it for winter. It, it is so beautiful. Yeah, I'm thrilled. I really am thrilled. Okay, so I got that done. Now, Boom. The next thing I worked on that I would just, I, I. Debbie loves it. I love it. She is like, Jack Frost Tree Farm is my favorite thing. Oh my gosh. And I got the, all the words done. Here we are, Little House Needleworks, Jack Fox Frost Tree Farm. And I'm doing it all as one, and I and I saw the other day, it's one, two, three, I think it's six. There's six below it, Kef, besides the oh, top. Oh, I see. Wow, Mom, look at that. Isn't that fun? And I got some more snow done all the way across. It looks so snowy. Oh, I just, I don't know. It's not it's... snowy here, so don't talk about that. Nope, we're not going to mention that, okay? And then on Teresa Colgate, Teresa, I got most of the border. We love Teresa. Look at this. What I, a creative genius. I got most of the border done. This and, is called Tis the Season that Debbie thought she lost. Oh my heck, I'm so glad I found it. And look at that. I've almost got the entire border wow, done. Wow, And then I started up with the green so you guys could see what the green looked like. That and then, looks fantastic. And then berries go in with the green. We love a good berry. Okay. So that's what I got done there. And then I started, I got more done on the um, Santa's Village. Wow. This is the Christmas tree farm 
one. Oh, I feel like we had five questions that I was supposed to answer this week. Oh, shoot. I'll pull them up. I got the um, red done and the white up on the top. So the house is basically finished. I'm just kind of filling it Which in. Which one is this one, Mom? That's the Christmas tree farm. To the right of it or the left of it on your side, there will be two trees. Thank you. Okay? So I got that done. Now, I did work on the made to create, but not enough to show you. I just got a few more stitches. Yeah, in. you guys don't care about three more stitches. Yeah, it, wasn't, it wasn't enough. <sighs> Thank you. It wasn't enough to show you, but I did, but it's fun. I love the colors. And I need to get the camera done. And then I'll, maybe by next week, and I'll show you that. So I got quite a bit of stitching done. Do what you say? You went buck wild. Okay, I went buck wild. All right, so you guys, I had... Um, I found a few questions, so when okay. you're ready. Okay, go ahead. The one thing I'd like to ask, does it... Oh. The one thing I'd like to ask about the stand. Oh, okay. Does it go up and down... For every, whatever position you're stitching. It does go up and down. That's does correct. it? Yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah. What about the pole with the clamp on it? Is that the part that goes up and down? No, the, the main body goes up and down. So that if you're on a higher chair, I can raise it or lower it. The clamp go, is like, what's, what's the word? It's part of the second piece? Yes, and it goes like this. Like you can, it's, it's um, I don't know how to explain it. But you can move it down like that or move it up. It, it You can crank it up or, or, or move it down. Got it. Um, the next one was, someone was saying, maybe we should take the camera upstairs again. They're like, I have the same thing and I can't fit a Q-snap in. Oh, I can easily fit a Q-snap in. In fact, it's best with a Q-snap. Yeah, like, that's what I didn't get about if I use a If I use a, um, what do they call, kept a little, um, a little these, hoop. If I use a hoop, it works, but the Q-snap is ideal. It's, it's made really for a Q-snap. So I don't know. And then, I didn't realize, I mean, did we like, oh, will your stitching stand work for a lazy boy recliner? Isn't your, aren't you in a lazy yeah, boy type? Mine's a lazy boy recliner. I don't know if it's, it's lazy massive. boy. It's not massive. I mean, mine's a smaller one, and it's not Lazy Boy. Right. Um, but yes, it would work. And mine is a smaller one. Um, but it would it works with it. I can just tuck it right underneath it. Um, if I had, I'd never put the the leg up. Do you know what I mean? Like you know how you, on a late on my lazy boy. Oh I can, right. I've never done that. But you should be able to, you should put, it be, to I could put it to the side, I think. I've never tried that, though. Mom, maybe you need to experiment yeah. tonight. Okay, I'll try tonight and t <laughs> tell you next week, okay? And then, okay, I swear we only talked about it for like one sentence last. What was last it? Last two. Bridgerton. Oh, dear. Every single person had a comment about it, okay? Okay. So have they watched it? They all think, oh, Debbie. That I, what? That I, what, what, oh, what, oh, Debbie? That I'm a prude? I don't know. Oh, I guess you're a little cons more conservative. <laughs> <laughs> I, I would watch Bridgerton. Do you know what? I, honestly, I, I'd love to know what your thought is. Okay. I just don't, you guys. I, I can't imagine Debbie watching it. I never watch TV, really. <laughs> You know what I mean? I don't, you guys. She watches, like, Mayberry. The only thing I'll ever watch is Mayberry because I don't have to watch it. Oh. I can listen to it, and I can see it in front of me because I know them so well. And I don't want to watch because yeah. I want to stitch. We tried to get Debbie to watch The Queen. I know. Oh, my gosh. But it was a little too heavy for her. Well, the Diana part was very upsetting to me. Yeah. I just didn't like that. But it was uh, The Crown. The crown. Did, the crown. Didn't you, I say the crown? You said the queen. The crown. Then, you guys, Dave starts watching this other Netflix one the other night called The Dig. So I go in and I'm like, hmm, I wonder what he's watching, you know? And it was so depressing. Oh, my God. I just God. like, it was a late, it was really Debbie cool. Debbie and I don't like depressing things. It was really cool. But you guys, Dave made such a funny statement. It was very interesting. It was a true story about a lady during the Second World War um, she owns this property yeah. outside of England. I saw a preview for it on Netflix. And, and she truly does find these mounds on her property. Okay. And it's like Viking ships. Like it's a true thing, right? Okay. And, and the Second World War is starting. I want to say it's 1936 or 37, 38. 1938 Great. maybe. 
And so then people are going off to war and then a plane comes over them and he's about to crash. Uh, uh, one of theirs, right? Okay. I mean, like, and so then he crashes into the sea, which is right by them. You know, there, there was just all of these things. But anyway, Dave said, this is so slow. <laughs> but you know, Dave likes bang him up, shoot him up. Right. He likes Liam Neeson. Yeah. You know. Anyway, and so he, but he really enjoyed it. I mean, because it's it's true, and it's art. It's about all the not agriculture. It's about the they dig up the the these boats. Really? Yeah. Uh huh. And they find all of these. Uh, it's a Anglo-Saxon, so it's prior to the. It's Northern European people that have come and tried to settle in um, England many, many, many years before. They find coins, they find armor, they find, anyway. And she then has to involve the British Museum. And so it's based on a true story. And she's like having heart trouble and she's got a little boy. Dad's already died. You know what I mean? I just, you know. So I watched it for a few minutes and then I left. And I went back in and watched Mayberry. Because then I don't have to watch it. But maybe we need to have you watch one episode of Bridget. Okay, all right, okay. It so, would be funny to see what her thoughts are. Okay, it will be my goal that this week I'll watch one episode. Can I just tell you that I had a friend that I went out to dinner with? You know who I'm talking about. Yes. And she said she was watching it. No, I had to turn it off. And she said, she said, she said my husband was in there. And I kept thinking he was going to leave. And I finally got so embarrassed that I turned it off. So I don't know. That, that's just our culture. Oh, is it? Do you think? Yes. Okay. All right. Okay. <laughs> don't get upset. Some people are like, oh, come on. I okay. mean, like, come on, people. Just let us live our lives. I'm sorry. You know, It's we're... so cute. It's romantic. <laughs> but it's, it's intense. Okay. I can't imagine Debbie watching it. Okay. If I watch the first. But I don't think the first episode. Oh, I guess there oh, is. Here's that boy. Which one? Here he is. Oh, here he is. He's I guess the first episode there is one scene. Okay. Do you want us to take him, Grandpa? I'm good for him. Oh, look at him. He's look, so happy. He's so happy. happy. We're having a good time. Okay. <laughs> All right. Okay. So, okay, so I guess our Bridget goal is, dear. I just told him about the dig. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Dave liked it, but again, it was a little slow for him. Yeah. Oh, and Dave went and saw, what was it called, dear? Oh, was it good? In, women in Motion. For women, black women in Motion. Women in Motion for Black History Month. And he went to the local theater where it was all about Ohura from Star Trek. Wow. And how she helped the NASA program. She was instrumental in no. giving. Yeah, yeah it's, she was huge, Cap. No kidding. And got black women, women of color, and diff and women in general to sign up to be astronauts. Wow! Yeah, they you they asked her to do it. NASA did. That's cool. Yeah, she had a an agreement with them. And anyway, I love that. Okay, so there you go. But you know how many people were in the theater? Just Dave. Just Dave. <laughs> <laughs> but Dave said it was very, very good. What it's, theater was it, Dad? The Farmington Cinema. Cinema. Yeah, Cinema. It was. It was a special thing. Like sometimes they do, like um, oh, what's it called? Kept like they'll do opera, Metropolitan Opera. It's a it was a like special art movie. Yeah, it wasn't. It was. Not, it was just like a one-time show. Yeah, that was it. Okay. All right. All right. This is it. We've got. I have to go get my hair cut. Oh yeah. What time is it? Four oh five. Okay. Here we go. So I went, to, away. I went to Craft Center of Fine Stitchery, and I just, first I'm going to show them this one. I wanted to get something that was just Eastery. And, it's cute. I almost wanted to do yeah, it. Yeah. I, I, I thought of you when I got it, you guys. Thank you, Mom. I went to get the Prairie Schooler bunnies, and they didn't have them. Because Traveling Viking Mama has influenced me. She is very influenced by traveling by I really mama am. on Instagram. I love these little bunnies that she's doing from Prairie Schooler, but they didn't have them. So I didn't pick them up, but I did see that one, two, three stitch had them. Okay. So I got this one. It is beautiful. They, it, it was stitched up of course at the store and it's just, it's beautiful. The okay? cricket collection, if you will. Yes. So and then, then show them this. Giveaway time. This is, um, on the bottom. It's, um, Sue Hillis. 
<gasps> okay. Sue Hillis. She is our stitcher in Cincinnati in Ohio. Sweet Sue. And I love all the stuff that she does. I have an apron one for the kitchen I want to do. But she, I saw this and they had this stitch. The apron up. one that Rika gave you? No, it's a different one. Oh. It, it's got an apron in it and it has it's kitchen stuff in it. Anyway, this one just caught my eye. OMG. It is very, very simple and straightforward. Simple Simon. But the colors were great. They also had this one stitched up. So, my friends, this is our giveaway, okay? For you this week, if you would like to win Happy Easter, are they going to have to answer a question, Kip? Or just, yes, they or just, are. Or just comment? You need to answer... Something about Easter, maybe. Something about Easter. What do we need to know? Um, something about... I'd be curious if they decorate for Easter. Do you put up Easter decorations? Yes. Don't you Good think? idea, Mom. Okay. And then... And then um, let us know. You can put Easter with... Yeah. Let us know if you decorate, and we will... Pull a winner. Pull because a winner. we've only got one. We don't have more we've than one. We've got one. Okay? But I got one for me or for Kef to do, because I knew she'd like it as well. Correct. Okay? So there's our giveaway for this week and what our, our Easter purchase. And I... I think that's it, okay? I think so too. Okay, and I can't even believe that Dave still has the Lincoln. Lincoln was, oh, wow. See, I do set him down. Oh, it's <laughs> wonderful. I just hand him off to somebody else. And somebody else holds him. Okay. Anyway. I was gonna tell him something else about you. What else was I gonna tell him about you? I don't know, um, nothing? Can... Okay, I can't think of it right I now. I don't know anything about okay. me. Okay, all right. So, you guys, um, thanks for joining with us this week. Uh, you know, I've been watching a cup. We just, oh, some some of the floss tubers give so much information about stitching. And, I know. Shame you know, on you. Oh, I feel bad. We so need I, to be like, oh, we're doing this on a linen. 38 count, evenly. I'm, I'm going to be better. Come okay? on, Mom. you got to up your game. I've got to up my game. Because they do tell you so much. So I'm going to be better. I'll tell you the information. I'm, do, being, I'm doing better about keeping track of all my stitches this Mom. week. Okay? There you go. All right. I got my nails. We're going to give oh. a shout out to Debbie for being a good grandma. Because I was on a verge of a mental breakdown on Saturday. And she took Lincoln for two hours, and I got my nails done and, and my toes. And that, and I don't know that it helped so much as Monday did. I think Monday just getting Monday away. was wild. It was kind of good for you to get yeah. away. So anyway, but anyway, there you go. We, we love you guys. We are so glad that you are out there. We hope that you'll come back and join us again next yes. week. Yes. I will give you more details next week. And I will have books next week, okay? Wow. I got the new Newberry book in, so I'll bring that. And I got the winner, the Newberry winner, the tiger one. And I also got a couple of other books that were up for the call to call that are beautiful. There's one about a bumblebee that Donna Ray would love. Um, so I'll bring that next week and show you those books. Okay? We love that. All right. You guys have a great week. We'll see you yeah. next week. Bye.